Hello Python programmers. So in this video, I'm going to show you that how you can convert the human audio or the human voice into the computerized voice that we usually hear. Okay, so first of all, let me tell you that what will be the process or the flow of execution. First of all, we'll take the input from the user using the speech recognition library of Python. We'll convert that into text and then we'll use the GTTS which is Google text to speech service to convert this text back to the computerized voice of Google okay so let's import the required libraries you need only two libraries here first is GTTS and the second is speech recognition so pip install uh, speech recognition make sure that the uh, S and the R is capital press enter and this package will be installed for you so let's import uh, let's install the second package which is called G uh, sorry G T T S press enter and this package will also be installed for you so with this being said and all the requirements satisfied let's get to our editor and start writing a code okay so now we are into our editor let's first import the required libraries speech recog uh, nation as SR and from GTTS import uh, GTTS and then we'll need OS so first of all let's create the infinite loop uh, which will capture all the audio messages for us then we'll create a variable for the recognizer class sr sorry sr dot recognizer here r should be capital and this is a class okay now with sr dot microphone as source because we are using the microphone as our source for our audio the uh, will create an audio variable which will listen to the audio from the mic and then we'll create a variable text which will eventually uh, extract the words or the sentences from this audio by using the Google service so it will be recognize Google and the parameter provided is the audio variable so we are gonna create a try and accept uh, so that our code is error free and I'll first of all print the text so that I can see that whatever I have said is correctly inserted in the audio or not now if the text is equal to equal to stop or the user wants to stop the process then what we'll simply do is we'll break this infinite loop and else or let's forget about else we'll simply get out of this if condition and write r dot recognize google which we have already written so we don't need this here uh, we'll create a voice variable 
and voice is equal to voice plus actually first let's create the voice variable here uh, voice variable is the variable which will contain all the uh, messages or the word that the user has said because this infinite loop will run for a few seconds and will run again so what will happen here is let's say that the user first said hello how are you so the voice variable will store hello how are you then the loop will run again and the user said something like okay my name is Harshit so it will also store hello my name is Harshit and whatever the sentence which was previously said it will store this now let's write the condition for the accept which will simply print uh, say something because the user hasn't said anything here now we need to convert the text into our audio file so we'll use our gtts here and the text is our audio variable uh, sorry voice variable actually because this is what uh, the variable contains the text or the sentences that the user has said the language is English this is US English and we don't want it to be slow so slow is false and we'll say char.save okay and the audio file name is one dot wave you can write whatever you want so let me explain you again here so what we are doing here is first of all this while loop will run continuously for a few seconds and this uh, speech recognition library of python will be uh, will take the input from the user using the microphone and then it will recognize using the gtt uh, sorry the speech recognition service of google and then convert it into text and if the user has said stop then this infinite loop will break and the current value which is stored in the voice variable will be uh, converted into audio and stored into one dot wave and if not it will continuously store into the voice variable so let's save this and go back to our folder and run this file shift plus mouse right click open powershell window here python one dot py and cannot import the name gtts okay now it should be capital gtts here from gtts import capital gtts okay only the first g is small otherwise the t t and s are capital okay, so let's run this again although i have to change the mic because this mic is not compatible with uh, google uh, sorry the speech recognition package of python i don't know why let me first check that whether it's working or not uh, so we aren't getting any error it means the program is running fine so let me change the mic and show you that uh, how the program is gonna work
okay so I have to interrupt the video because I was getting some error and it took me some time to resolve that but as you can see I got the result so first of all let me show you the changes that I have made to uh, get this program running first of all include all the code after taking the input from the user from the microphone so that uh, if the user hasn't entered anything that then this goes to the accept loop uh, or the accept condition and it prints say something uh, so this was the first error and the second error was this was not ENG this was EN only this is US English and uh, now I don't think so there was any error yeah uh, all the commands after the taking the input from the user is included into the try and accept and this was en so this was it for this video and you will get the uh, audio file into a folder by by one dot wave and you can play it and see that uh, you will get the computerized voice of your said words and so this is it for this video this was a small but fun project i know this is not a very resume type project but still it was fun to create and maybe you can use this small concept in your some bigger project so this is it and in my channel i create such small but awesome projects so if you if you want to create some then check out my channel and i'll meet you there bye bye